My name is Monika Zagrobelna and this is how to create a sketch effect action in Adobe Photoshop originally written by Marco Kozakar on Elvato Tatspas. In this tutorial I'm going to teach you how to create a Photoshop sketch effect. You will learn how to turn your photos into amazing advanced sketches. I will try to explain everything in so much detail that everyone can create it, even those who have just opened Photoshop for the first time. First, open the photo that you want to work with. Before we get started, just check a couple of things. Your photo should be in RGB color mode 8 bits per channel. To check this, go to Image Mode. For best results, your photo size should be between 1500 and 4000 pixels wide. To check this, go to Image Image Size. Your photo should be the background layer. If it's not, go to Layer New Background from Layer. To make some auto corrections to your photo tone, contrast, and color, go to Image, Auto Tone, Image, Auto Contrast, and then Image, Auto Color. Go to Layer, New Fill Layer, Solid Color to create a new solid color fill layer. Name it Background Color and use this color. Select the background layer and go to Layer, New, Layer via Copy. To duplicate the background layer and then drag that new layer to the top. Press D on your keyboard to reset the swatches and go to Filter, Filter Gallery, Sketch, Photocopy. Use the same values as me. Name this layer Base Sketch and change its blending mode to Multiply. Go to Layer, New, Layer via Copy to duplicate the Base Sketch layer. Go to Edit. Free transform and increase the width and height to 105%. Name this layer Large Draft Sketch and set its opacity to 14%. Select the Base Sketch layer and go to Layer, New, Layer via Copy to duplicate the Base Sketch layer again. This time change the size to 95%. Name this layer Small Draft Sketch and set its opacity to 14%. Select the background layer and go to Layer, New, Layer via Copy. Drag it to the top. Go to Filter, Filter Gallery, Artistic, Cutout and use the same values as me. Go to Filter, Stylize, Find Edges and then go to Image, Adjustments, Desaturate. Name this layer RS1 change its blending mode to color burn and drop its opacity to 30%. Repeat the same process five times, each time adding one to the edge simplicity. Make the opacity of each layer gradually lower until you reach about 7%. the layer RS6 is selected, shift click on the RS1 layer, then go to Layer, New, Group from Layers and name the group Rough Sketch. Now we are going to create some subtle shading. Select the background layer and go to Layer, New, Layer via Copy to duplicate the background layer. Drag it to the top. Go to Filter, Stylize, Find Edges and then go to Image, Adjustments, Desaturate. Go to Filter, Filter Gallery, Brush Strokes, Angled Strokes and select these settings. Name this layer Shading 1, change its blending mode to Multiply and drop its opacity to 12%. Create another desaturated layer with edges and then go to Filter, Filter Gallery, Brush Strokes, Crosshatch. Use these values. Name this layer Shading 2, change its blending mode to Multiply drop its opacity to 5% and drag it under the Shading 1 layer to keep the proper layer order. Select the Shading 1 layer and go to Layer, New, Layer to create a new layer and name it Noise. Go to Edit, Fill and use Black. Go to Filter, Noise, Add a Noise and use this value. 
Now change the blend mode to screen and drop the opacity to 64%. Go to Layer, New Adjustment Layer, Curves and name it Color Look. Adjust the curve for each color until you achieve the effect you like. Go to Layer, New Adjustment Layer, Photo Filter and name it Photo Tint. Use these settings. Go to Layer, New Adjustment Layer, Gradient Map and name it Overall Contrast. Change the Blend Mode to Soft Light and drop the Opacity to 18%. Go to Layer, New Adjustment Layer, Vibrance and name it Overall Vibrance Saturation. Change its settings. Go to Layer, New Adjustment Layer, Levels and name it Overall Brightness. Adjust its settings. Press Ctrl, Alt, Shift, E to make a snapshot. Go to Filter, Other, High Pass and enter these settings. Name this layer Overall Sharpening, change its blending mode to Hard Light and drop the opacity to 76%. Now you know how to create a Photoshop sketch effect. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and thanks for watching.